Hey guys, so I posted this picture on Instagram of these products that I just recently purchased over the weekend. And And I was like, I have to go ahead and tell you guys about this company, YH by J. YH by J. I'm probably saying the name so wrong, but the thoughts that I have of this brand, you guys are going to be like, whoa. So YH by J Cosmetics is an affordable cosmetics line, and they remind me of the Wet n Wild makeup company. Now let me explain to you guys YH by J. YH by J is kind of at your local glitter if you have a mall where you have a local glitter that's where I basically get most of my jewelry from then YH by J's have their own little makeup section and it says uh, YH by J and everything in that collection is two dollars so these blushes that I'm going to talk to you guys about today is two dollars so let me start with the first blush I ever brought from the company it is called number four they don't have a certain color they have numbers and this is before they came out with their newest packaging I've shown this blush in tutorials I mean this blush is definitely great they remind me of the MAC blushes and that's what they look like right now like these are awesome has a little rose and the the packaging is something like this like it has a three set it has your front it has the part where you have a little mirror and then it has a place where you can put the brush in but I don't use their brushes so um, I, I rather use my regular blush brushes to apply it. and I think that I love the payoff of this blush because it gives a rosy glow to your face even if you're not using a lot of makeup this blush gives like a pop a hint to the face and I'm going to do like a little swatch on the hand of this first blush. And this is in shade 4. Okay, that's the swatch on my fingers. And here is it on my hand. Do you see the pigmentation of that blush? Like, this is number 4. I love these blushes because they are just smooth and you have some blushes where they're powdery. You have some blushes where they just don't even blend. Like, I love these blushes because they're blendable, affordable, and also they're smooth and creamy. And you wouldn't even have a problem with blending in with these blushes. But I have to say about these blushes, you have to be very careful. One little tap on a makeup brush it's perfect it's just fine because if you really overdo it you start to look like a clown so if you want to refuse to have a clown look on your face when you are using these blushes from YH by Z then you need to just do one little tap make sure you smile to define the apples of your cheeks and bring it back towards your little sideburn or whatever <laughs> and just make sure you blend a little bit and boom perfect so I have on today is this blush here it's a peachy blush now these packaging right here are just a little bit different and I guess these are their newest packagings because I saw in the store the display of these things was like crazy I wanted to buy every single color but I was like let me test out these three so I just did number four from the original old packaging and then this is YH by J blush in one. One is like a little nice little translucent color in the crease in your eyes. And also it just gives it like a little nice little natural blush that which I am wearing right now. And I'm going to go ahead and swatch this blush. This is the pigmentation. It's like a bronzy peach. So you can barely... So I have it on my hand because it's so smooth. Maybe I need to do a better off swatch. Because it's so natural. That's probably why I didn't get a great swatch of it because it's so natural. Okay, there you go. Right there. So that's that blush. And also, uh, it has the brush that comes with it. See how tiny that is? Like, what is this with these cheeks right here? It's going to do with this little brush. But I'm just going to still keep it in there. And it has a mirror just like the other one. 
So, got a little mirror. I guess they give it to you if you fit. I guess they thought we were going to be some type of people that's going to just drop it in our makeup bag. See, I'm not really big on makeup bags for like for traveling. Yeah, that'll work in the coming handy. Next, I have is the shade number four. And that was the shade number one. So number one and four kind of looks alike. But this one is more of a darker one. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch number four. Ooh, perfect for a translucent color. I think I'm going to like this. And I think this will really show up on the sisters that are fair. And I really think that this is perfect. And you can't even see it on my complexion. See, I'm swatching it right now. That's how peachy it is. But here's a swatch of it on my hand though, my, my finger. <laughs> but um, yeah, so that is number four. And uh, I need to do number three. Number three is more of a rosy, rosy color. It kind of reminds me of the first one that I just swatched a little bit. See? They're similar. So I think I'm going to get the same result as I did with the first swatch. So let's try and see. I'm gonna see if I can get a good swatch of it. Obviously, I need to probably go in a little bit more. Okay. Mm, a little bit not the best swatch as this one, but these probably look well on fair skin tones, but the one that I'm wearing on today, which is this one right here, number one. Oh, that, that, that did great. Like, I'm proud of number one. But yeah, if you want to um, get uh, your hands on these blushes, I'm pretty sure eBay has them and Amazon. But if you have a look of glitter in your mall, then don't try to... First, I would want you guys to go see if you have it in your local glitter. And then if not, try on eBay. They probably have them. And they probably are selling them for cheap prices, too. Really great prices. So that was it for this little mini review of the YH by J blushes. And I hope you guys found that this review was helpful. If you're looking for affordable blushes, and these blushes are uh, what you will need to start out with your collection. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!